హలో నమస్తే సలాం వాలేకుం శాస్త్రీయకాల్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు అనదర్ సెషన్ విత్ యువర్ వాష్ ఆఫ్ ఎట్ వారేవా డాట్ కామ్ వీ లవ్ టు మేక్ ఎగ్ స్క్రాంబుల్డ్ ఎగ్స్ అండ్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ ఎగ్స్ యూజింగ్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ టమాటోస్ అండ్ టమాటో సాసెస్ బట్ టుడే ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు మేక్ ఎ డిష్ కాల్డ్ సాక్షుక దిస్ ఈజ్ వెరీ ఈజీ అండ్ వెరీ టేస్టీ అండ్ స్పెషలీ ఇట్ లుక్స్ ఫంటాస్టిక్ సో డియర్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ లెట్స్ గో ఇట్ అండ్ మేక్ దిస్ డిష్ ఫర్ దిస్ టేక్ సమ్ ఆలివ్ ఆయిల్ ఇన్ అ ప్యాన్ ఇన్ దిస్ యాడ్ సమ్ చాప్డ్ ఆనియన్ and also add some chopped garlic okay we're going to saute this uh, onion and garlic till this is slightly sweated and you get this awesome aroma from this in this add chili powder or paprika powder i'm going to add a little extra wow add salt and you know to indianize this i'm going to add some curry powder and wow adding curry powder makes this excellent and i'm going to add some thyme this will give a very nice flavor to this once this is slightly sorted we're going to add the tomato kankase you know the kankase means the tomatoes have been blanched the skin removed and these have been nicely chopped this is a very simple dish with the nice awesome flavors and uh, wow you know add pinch of sugar this will make this even more tasty and add some stock you know chicken stock will make this even more better if you want to add vegetable stock if you are an vegetarian just reduce it little bit and then we're going to add cheese i'm not going to use the feta cheese as they do it i'm just going to add some paneer this is a soft creamy paneer just uh, put some uh, soft cream paneer crumble. into this just crumble this soft uh, paneer okay now look at this this is neither too thin nor too thick the sauce is perfect and this uh, cheese the paneer is also nicely mixed up and we're going to transfer this into oven proof dish look at this wow you know what an aroma with this all these herbs especially thyme parsley wow now we are going to break the egg in a bowl just to make sure that the eggs are good sometimes you can get eggs that are not good and just make a well like thing with a spoon and then just pour this on top of this like this we are going to pour six eggs that's good enough for this much uh, now just pour one egg after another till this is nicely evenly distributed see this is perfect six eggs now to make this sakshuka nice and awesome i am just mix some thyme parsley basil with some salt and made this into herb salt and just around the egg on the white just sprinkle this wow now even while you are baking this herbs will slightly get baked and will taste fantastic if any of the extra herb is there just sprinkle all over and now this is ready to go into the baking oven we are going to put this in the oven at 180 degrees centigrade for around 10 minutes now while this is nice fuming hot just sprinkle some parsley wow and this is awesome all done and ready to be enjoyed dear friends this is very easy why regular ande ka burji sometimes make something like this and your kids and everybody will enjoy look at this shakshuka you know fantastic and you, even if you put for like 10 minutes in the oven these are getting fully cooked but if you want them a little bit soft remove it off by 7 8 minutes and the aroma because of so many herbs and awesome flavoring this is already smelling good and also i know this taste good wow this is good lot of flavors and uh, with a nice bread on the side mm you know this tomato and the egg just very simple like this this tastes super awesome dear friends i hope you enjoyed learning how to make this awesome shakshuka but do not forget varava is all about inspiring others to cook So please post your recipes and cooking tips at varava.com so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you. <sighs>